Hi, I'm Ema, and I'm a mom and a grandma, and I have the funniest story to read to you right now. It's called Naked Mole Rat Gets Dressed. So, it's going to be kind of a little opposite than people, I think. Let's take a look here. There is so much to learn about the fascinating little creatures known as naked mole rats. But for this story, you only need to know three things. One, they are a little bit rat. Two, they are a little bit mole. And three, they are all naked. Except, they were, except for one exception. So here's what they look like. Normally, that's how they look. But, Wilbur, the naked mole rat, who liked to get dressed. Hello. Wilbur's gotten dressed. He's getting dressed. And what did the other moles say? When the other naked mole rat saw him, they said, Ew! Yuck! What are you doing? They thought it was really weird. I like clothes, said Wilbur. When I get dressed, I can be fancy or funny or cool or I can just be an astronaut. When the others heard that, they said, Ew! Yuck! If you like clothes so much, then why don't you open a store or something? That's what this one said. Naked mole rats can be very sarcastic. But it does look like the Wilbur's kind of thinking about, hey, maybe I should open a store. Doesn't it look like that? See, Wilbur thought it was a good idea. He opened a clothing store where he sells clothes. The other naked mole rats did not think it was a good idea. They brought Wilbur to a giant portrait of Grand Pa, the oldest, greatest, and most naked, naked mole rat ever. Look at that picture, they demanded. Look at his heroic face. Look at his regal bearing. Look at his total lack of clothing, they said. And again, I'm showing you the picture of the naked mole rat, the Grand Pa. Grand Pa did look heroic. Grand Pa did look regal. But he would also look heroic and regal in a casual shirt and some summer slacks. Ugh, said the other naked mole rats, don't you get it? Ew. Naked mole rats don't wear clothes. See how they're just jumping up and down and having a Conniption fits. Have you ever heard that word? Conniption fits. And Wilbur said, why not? Something had to be done. Oh, look. These naked mole rats. They're kind of angry. Have you, can you say naked mole rats? Did you notice that sometimes I say naked rat moles? I don't mean to, though. Or sometimes I say naked roll mats. <laughs> <laughs> okay, but it's naked mole rats, and that's what they're really called. They really don't talk, though. This is a good story. Well, I've never heard them talk. Maybe you have. The naked mole rats marched right over to Grandpa in person and told him all about Wilbur. Here they are. There's Grandpa. Grandpa was very wise. He thought seriously about everything he heard. Hmm. Ah. Oh. Hmm. And then he thought.
thought some more. Thinking, thinking, thinking. Finally, he said in a heroic, regal voice, Gather the colony. I shall make a proclamation. When Wilbur heard about Grandpa's proclamation, he knew it was serious. A proclamation, a proclamation, a proclamation, everybody said. And look at Wilbur, he's, mm -hmm. he knows it's serious. But he had no idea what to wear. Which one do you think he should wear to go hear the proclamation? I think he should wear the cowboy outfit. In the end, Wilbur decided to play it safe. And he didn't wear anything. Because, you know, he was a naked mole rat, and naked mole rats usually don't wear anything. So, so there he went. Looks like he did leave his socks on, though. Maybe not safe enough. Here are all the other naked mole rats all lined up. The others were so busy looking at Wilbur's socks that no one noticed Grandpa enter until he cleared his throat <coughs> and he proclaimed, Fellow naked mole rats, I had never worn clothes until I heard Wilbur's simple question, Why not? Why not indeed? Do clothes hurt anyone? No. Are they fun? Well, they may not be fun for everyone. But this old naked mole rat wishes he had tried getting dressed earlier. And there's Grandpa with some clothes on. And look how everybody's just shocked. What? Say what? <laughs> then Grandpa complimented Wilbur on his socks. As fast as his legs would take him, Wilbur rushed home, put on his favorite outfit, and dashed back. Woohoo, there he goes, fast as he could. Can you get dressed really fast? I bet that's helpful. And that's his favorite outfit, and I like that outfit too. It looks very, very sharp. When he returned, Wilbur discovered he was not alone. See how some of the other Naked roll mats? Naked roll mats. Naked mole rats had clothes on too. Much has been said about that day, but for this story, you only need to know three things. Some of the mole rats were naked. Some of the mole rats were clothed. All of the mole rats had a great time. No exceptions. And here's Wilbur back at his store where he sells clothes. The end. Is that a fun story? Naked Mole Rat Gets Dressed. And that's by Mo Willems. I hope you enjoyed that story. And I hope you can get dressed just as fast as Wilbur. That will come in handy, huh? Okay, remember, I love you. Have a great day.